for your dolly poly sleep has flown. Don't dare let her tremble for the Merlin Santana was born on March 14, 1976 in New York City to Dominic Republic immigrants. Wanting a life that would keep him off the tough streets of New York City, Merlin's parents got him into show business as a child star, where at the tender age of three, he was an advertising model for a fast food chain. It would be the year 1985 when Merlin would land his first on-screen appearance as an extra in the movie. The Purple Rose of Cairo, and in 1991, where he would land his first important role, where he played Stanley on The Cosby Show, a troubled teen in Theo Huxtable's class that would eventually become Rudy's boyfriend and the rival of Rudy's friend Kenny, played by Dion Richmond. It wouldn't be the last time Merlin and Dion would work together, though, because in 1993, the two were cast as brothers Marcus and Darren in the hit TV show Getting By, which lasted for a year. Merlin would then go on to play many roles in other hit TV shows like Sister Sister, Hanging with Mr. Cooper, Moesha, and The Steve Harvey Show to name a few. His last film role was in the comedy film The Blues, which was released in 2003. That night, while leaving a friend's house in the Crenshaw district of Los Angeles, Merlin and his friend Brandon Adams got into a car when all of a sudden, two men came running up from behind armed with a rifle and a revolver. The one with the rifle, who would later on be identified as Damien Andre Gates, fired off a shot which penetrated the trunk, went through the right front passenger seat, and struck Merlin in the head. His friend drove off until he was able to flag down a nearby police officer which checked on Merlin, but by that time, Merlin had passed away. He was pronounced dead at the scene. As time went by, police would eventually arrest three people and charge them with Merlin Santana's murder. They were Damien Andre Gates, Brandon Douglas Bond, and Monique King. Their motive? Monique King was supposed to visit Merlin and his friend at a house where they were recording music that night. She was then to case out the house looking for valuables and report back to Damien and Brandon where they would break in and steal everything afterwards. But Monique got nervous and she backed out of the plan. But to save her own skin, she told the would-be robbers that Merlin and his friend had made sexual advances towards her, and this caused the gunman to act out of vengeance. In the end, Damien Gates was convicted of first-degree murder and sentenced to three consecutive life sentences, plus 70 years. Brandon Bynes was convicted with voluntary manslaughter and assault with a deadly weapon after entering a plea of guilty. He received 23 years in prison. Monique King, though 15 years old at the time, was tried as an adult and convicted of second degree murder and attempted murder. She received 10 years in a juvenile detention center. Merlin Santana was buried at the St. Raymond Cemetery in the Bronx, New York on November 18, 2002. He was 26 years old. For your dolly, dolly sleep has flown.